I'm James Brent and I'm the new chairman of the Plymouth City Development Company. Tell me about your, uh, your role at the CDC. Well, my, my role at the CDC is, is as non-executive chairman, so I will be part-time uh, helping Paul Carroll, who's our new chief executive and full-time, to meet the City Development Company's agenda. And the agenda of the CDC is really to drive change and to help the city meet the vision that it's already articulated to the community. I think over time, inevitably, that vision will be moderated, it'll change. But the purpose of the CDC is not to create further vision, it's to execute upon the agreed plan. And what would your message be for people in Plymouth? What would you hope to, to see from them to, to enable the CDC to work? I think really it, 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 it's twofold. I mean, the, the CDC itself is going to be a very small organisation and, and quite appropriately so. So it's not going to have the resources to affect the change. I think what it can be is the catalyst of the change. And I think what we need from the, the people of, uh, of Plymouth really is two things. And very importantly, one is to be supportive of the CDC in setting change agenda. And secondly, I think almost more importantly, to hold our feet to the fire, and it's not just, as I say, us, it's the business community, it's the, it's the public sector in various guises, but to hold us accountable to achieve the agreed change agenda, because I think the danger with this is that we have the launch today, and uh, it becomes a talking shop, and in 24 months' time, we still have a really interesting vision but we're not moving down the steps of executing that plan. So it, it, it really is holding us to be accountable alongside our partners who've been great in the form of Ply Plymouth City Council, the Regional Development Agency, English Partnerships, and the, uh, the, the business community. Paul Carroll, I'm the uh, new chief executive for the Plymouth City Development Company. Tell me a bit about your role at the CDC. As a chief executive, actually we're at the beginning periods of the implementation of the CDC. Last night we had the first chance to meet with our board and we're at the point now of looking at what deliverables and what areas the CDC needs to take the leadership and what areas it needs to be supportive to other stakeholders. And most importantly, get that out to the people of Plymouth and say, here's what we're going to do as our first steps. Here are our benchmarks, judge us against that. And the most important part is then take those deliverables, the immediate ones, get them in the time frames that we announce and say to us, here's what we've done. We ask for your continued support for the next generation of deliverables. What can people expect from the CDC? How would you like to see it function? I'd like to see it. It's, it's, I believe that the CDC has that role. It's one of the stakeholders, and I've said it before, about a renaissance for Plymouth. I think the CDC has a key role in leading some of those efforts and, again, supporting some of those others. I think the important part of the CDC, and this is what really attracts me to Plymouth and why I think Plymouth is so much further ahead than a lot of other communities. And it's the commitment across the sectors, the commitment of the public, the private, academic, scientific, cultural, and most importantly, the people of Plymouth. CDC needs to make sure that they keep those relationships strong. We're not always going to agree, but any good relationship weathers that, but we need to make sure that what the CDC is doing is moving forward and working with the stakeholders to move forward. And what's your message to the people of Plymouth? I'm just, first of all, honored to have been chosen for this position. Um, I hope the people of Plymouth realize it's been talked about a lot of potential in Plymouth. This is much further than potential. There are so many resources that already exist. I want them to realize that as a CDC, we want to realize those um, for the benefit of all the people of Plymouth.